In this video, I will be breaking down the five steps that you need to follow if you also want to build and run your own short form content agency. If you follow this video step by step and you combine the knowledge together with hard work, then you will also see success just like me and my students. Because just super quick, who is this guy telling you all this? I scaled my own content agency to more than $20,000 in the time span of six months. And the purpose of this video is to simplify and break down those six months so that you can avoid the mistakes that I made. Let's jump right into it. Step one, pick a niche. We want to work with one group of people and want to establish ourselves as the go-to guy or the expert for that specific group of people. Let's go with mindset coaches as an example. First of all, we want to research mindset coaches and their businesses. We need to find out what they struggle with, what they spend a lot of time doing, what they love to do, what they offer. And overall, we just need as much information as possible about their business. And most importantly, how we can help them. I would recommend interviewing a handful of mindset coaches simply just to understand their business better. Based on all of this information, we can build a relevant offer, an offer that solves their biggest problem. And when we have picked the niche, researched it and created a relevant offer, then we can move on to step two, build the foundations. Now that we've picked our niche, it is 10 times easier when we have to set up our social accounts and build our landing page. Because everything that we have to do is to evolve around mindset coaches. We have one avatar in mind and everything that we post, create or do is for that mindset coach. Feel free to follow Follow this checklist whenever you're setting up the foundations. An Instagram bio that is relevant to mindset coaches. It should mention what you offer, who you help and how you do it. You should also include short form content for yourself and all of the content should talk about how mindset coaches could improve from working with you, using content, book more calls or whatever it is. You should also set up a landing page for mindset coaches. The way that I do it is that I have a landing page where people can come in and get something for free if they in return give me their information. So as an example for mindset coaches, you could create a free ebook on how mindset coaches consistently can book qualified sales calls for their business. And the only thing that the mindset coach should do is simply just give their email and phone number and then they can collect the freebie and you will have a potential leads contact information. On your social accounts, I would also include lifestyle posts and slide posts that builds credibility, builds value, because in the end, business is done with people and people need to trust you. Step three, outreach. Now we have everything that we need in order to start outreach. We have a strong online presence, a converting landing page, and we have a clear niche where we have an offer that actually solves their problem. All of these things ensures that we have a high reply rate on our outreach. The platforms that we'll be using are LinkedIn, Facebook, and Instagram, and of course also email. Again, this depends on your needs and where your avatar is most likely to be found. The only way that you can find the best platform is by split testing all of them and tracking your numbers. Let's go back to the example of mindset coaches. We have to understand that whenever we are working with people, coaches, consultants, spammy automated emails doesn't work. We need to actually connect with them on a personal level. And some of the best ways that you can do it is again by following this checklist. You can send them a selfie video or you can send them a voice message to increase the open rate. You can reply on an active story to make sure that you land inside of their primary inbox. You should also make sure to structure your email the right way and remember a personalized first line. My personal favorite is provide something of value up front. It can be a free edit, a free content plan, or some sort of free tip so that the mindset coach can fully understand that you are the expert when it comes to helping mindset coaches scale their business. Make sure to track your outreach, track your platforms, and focus on building the strong foundation in step two too, because all of the hard work that you put into the content, the freebie, the landing page, all of that will increase your reply rate and thereby you will maximize your time and effort. Step four, learn sales. When you combine a strong offer that is created for one specific group of people with a strong online presence and a cool looking landing page and also do quality outreach that is personalized for all of your prospects, well, then you will be finding yourself booking a lot of meetings. And don't worry about sales experience experience you will learn along the way and to help you out feel free to use the exact two call close process that I use. The first call is a discovery call. It is basically an interview where you just learn everything about that potential client. So you ask them questions about their business, how they acquire customers, how they use social media, how much revenue they're doing now and how much they want to do. You want to take
take a step back after that call and then you want to prepare for the sales call. So in the end of the discovery call, just end the call off by saying, hey prospect, this was an awesome call. Based on all of that information you provided, I'll now take a few days and then prepare a tailored solution created just for you and your business. And then you simply just invite them for the second call, which is the sales call. As I said, in the meantime, take a step back and build a tailored plan made for that exact client. So if their goal was to go from 10K to 50K a month, then of course you tailor your offer in a way where they can understand that the solution for them in order to go from A to B is you and make sure on that second call that you don't come across too salesy instead of hitching them right away make sure to like bring up the last call that you had with them remember their whys their business their problems and then you want to pitch your solution in a very natural way where instead of you are pushing them to buy they slowly just realize that hey this is actually the solution to my problem and then you're more likely to sell them something they have to believe your service and your offer is the vehicle to get them from their current situation to their ideal situation. Step five, be more than an editor. A lot of people get this wrong when they hear about short form content agencies. You can now separate yourself from the rest by understanding this one simple thing. Short form content is the main service because it is the vehicle that drives traffic onto your client's product or service. But you have to understand that short form content does not sell the product or service that your client offers. It simply just brings the traffic. So your number one job is to convert the attention into cold cash for your clients. And the only way that you can do that is by learning funnels. Funnels is very quickly explained. It's simply just a process that happens when someone stumbles upon your client's product or service and then all of these steps until they buy. Here are a few funnels and upsells that I always teach my students to combine with their short form content offer because the combination of traffic is a crazy good offer. You can offer a pre-built landing page with a VSL or a free you can offer a email flow together with weekly campaigns. You can also offer dial the leads, which means that all of the people that goes to the landing page, gives their information, is getting dialed from either the client or you. And you can also offer them a free community, which is basically just a nurturing place where you can send the traffic to. So again, if it's a mindset coach, you love this short form content video, go check out my free Facebook group where I share free tips every single day. And then you know that all of the people that will join that Facebook group, well, then they're pretty interested in working with that mindset coach for example and you'll quickly realize that by adding all of these different upsells services funnels you become irreplaceable because now you're not just an editor handling your clients videos you're actually the person that takes care of all growth you create the attention and you also turn the attention into cash because of the funnels and all of the things that you have now upsold to the client and that is it that is how you build and scale an irreplaceable short form content agency in five simple steps. Find a niche, create a great offer that solves your niche's biggest problems. Then you want to build strong foundations through a tailored online presence, a good looking landing page that talks to your ideal customer. When everything is set up, you dive into personalized outreach through the social media accounts that you've just set up. Make sure to bring value up front so people are more likely to trust you because when people trust you, they'll also get on a call with you and then of course you know the two call close process so make sure to have a super smooth interview discovery call and then create a tailored game plan for that client bring them on for a second call and then of course you close them and then you now have a client Congratulations. And when you have that client, make sure that you deliver more than just content. Make sure that you understand funnels, make sure you understand upsells, and make sure that you become a growth partner instead of an editor. So thank you so much for watching this video. I know it was a lot of information with content and funnels and niches and all of those things. If you want to learn more about the specific topics that I covered in this video, feel free to check out my other videos here on YouTube where I go more in depth with all of those things. So thank you so much for watching this video. Video, feel free to drop a like and a subscribe if you enjoyed it and then I'll just see you next week for the new video.